With regard to people's concept of um, abstraction and abstract art and contemporary art versus the layperson's understanding of fine art, do you find with regard to teaching um, a style that is much more outside of the box but more intuitive to people's emotions, do you find that hard to convey or, or do your techniques when you're teaching kind of speak for themselves? Um, I don't find it hard to convey but um, <clears throat> it's not easy. Being, being creative is, 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 really, is a really difficult thing. What I try to do is to help people unlock their ideas and um, find a, a vocabulary of their own, a, 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 a metaphorically speaking, a vocabulary of paint, painting, mark making. And um, that's, that's the idea. I mean, it, it's really, I, I find abstraction a real challenge. That's why, that, that, that's why I love it. it, it it's, and and when, you, when it does work, you do really do get to the essence of the subject matter, uh, for me anyway. Um, and it, 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 it's, it's the same, as, um, it's the same process as, as writing a piece of music or something, or writing a, a book. You know, you, stand, you start with, right, you start with a, a blank piece of paper, same as a blank canvas, you know, and just come up with something. It's really, it's, it's far more difficult than, than recording what you can see. Um, okay, you can put your own mark on that, you can make, make that, uh, you, you, you can put a style to it, but it's, it's more difficult being creative and, and co or composing, if you like, you're composing with paint. And I think also with regard to tapping into that, uh, I, I still think it is an intuitive thing once you tap into it. That's where, in my belief, uh, that art makes a difference in the world, where you can convey a message in a way that people might not necessarily recognise immediately, but on a deeper level, I think it, it does engage with people uh, without it being too literal. And I think that's the important message that art can convey whether it be you know some flowers or or really really deep graphic ex extractions it's abstractions it's um it's really it is what becomes emotive in my opinion anyway yeah yeah it's it's um you should approach it the same way as you would um listen to a, a piece of um a piece of music you know without lyrics uh, uh, an instrumental piece of music um, you don't say, oh, well, what's that about? You, <laughs> you, uh, you enjoy it for what it is, the combination of the notes, and etc., and the, the, you know, the layers, the, um, the composition itself. And it's the same, same with abstraction. You can enjoy it just for that. And then you can, you, you can get it later, you know, if there's a subject matter there with it. Some, some abstraction doesn't really have a subject matter. It's a statement in itself. But um, it's, it's, you can approach it on many different levels. It's the same, same as music. Can you um, tell us our, the for this recording? Can you tell us that lovely story you you told us earlier about that emotion that you felt um, when you were listening to that music? Oh, that was a little bit embarrassing. Um, <clears throat> I was in Seville with my wife, and uh, we we happened upon a, um, it was a it was a small space where they where they do flamenco dancing and. Um, there's lots of them all over Seville, and uh, the, I just said, "Do you fancy going to see one?" Because I was interested in the, in, in the guitar playing, and um, and yeah, we went we went along that night, and uh, we went along every night after that to a different one every night because I was so moved by by the whole thing, the passion of it, and and um, I was visibly moved, and um, somebody said pointed to me and said, Duende, and uh, apparently Duende is, is, is your emotions, and when it comes to the surface, that's what it is. And I, I'm generally attracted to, to trying to paint things that, that um, exist, but, but you can't see. And um, so I've produced a piece of work uh, recently called Duende, which is, um, is trying to depict that. And I think by using abstraction, like I said, 
closer to that subject matter.